How to predict formation pressure prior to drilling? Formation pressure can be predicted from three information sources, which are seismic data, geological data and historical data. This video will discuss about these information. Seismic is the way to predict formation types by sending sound waves that penetrate into subsurface structure. Then, sound waves reflected back from formation, are recorded as raw data. Geologists are able to predict geological structures, and potential pressured zoned, by interpreting the sound waves. With current 3D seismic modeling, the pressured zones are accurately predicted. Geological information demonstrates some conditions, that possibly causes abnormal pressure zones. The subsurface structures associated with abnormal pressure characteristics are anticlines, charged zones, depleted zones, faults, massive shale and salt formations. Anticlines is the geological structure that looks like a dome. Anticlines with cap rocks on top are good geological structure because hydrocarbon can possibly trapped below it. While drilling into top structure of anticlines, abnormal pressured zones can possibly be seen. Charged zones are shallow formations that have pressure connectivity from abnormal pressure zones below. Because of upward movement of reservoir fluid from deeper zones, charged zones are normally abnormal pressure. Charged zones can occur by nature or man-made. Currently, New geophysical methodologies can be applied for find where the charged zones are prior to drilling. Depleted zones have less pressure than original formation pressure, because some reservoir fluid have been produced. Using historical data in conjunction with geological techniques can determine where the possibly depleted zones are. A fault is a planar fracture or discontinuity in a volume of rock which there has been significant displacement as a result of rock mass movement. Because each fault block may has different pressure gradient, while drilling across a fault, drilling problem associated with pressure such as well control problem or lost circulation may possibly happen. Shale is a non-permeable formation, therefore it restricts movement of formation fluid. When overburden formation layers are accumulated over massive shale, shale is compacted and reservoir fluid naturally tries to come out from the pore space. However, shale is impermeable and it does not allow pore fluid to come out, therefore formation pressure caused by formation fluid becomes overpressured. There are several parts of the world where pure and thick layers of salt are present. Typically, Salt formations are laterally and upwards forced causing salt domes. Because salt is impermeable, it does not allow formation fluid to pass through it, therefore, formations below a salt formation are possibly abnormal pressure. The historical data from adjacent areas is good information for prediction formation pressure. Historical information can be obtained from existing formation pressure, mud logging reports, drilling reports, drilling fluid report, logging while drilling, pressure while drilling, and etc. Thank you for watching. If you like our oil field training video, please subscribe to our mailing lists and YouTube channel.